Hey everyone, welcome back to DevOps Unlocked, a channel dedicated to helping you along your DevOps journey. In today's video, we are going to be discussing the serial option within Ansible. So by default, Ansible runs in parallel against all hosts. If you want to manage a few machines at a time, for example, during a rolling update, you can define how many hosts Ansible deploys to using the serial option. Okay, so before we begin, I wanted to diagram out what we're going to be doing as part of this demo. So here we have our two web servers and our control node. We're going to SSH to the one on the left. It's going to go through the process of restarting Apache and confirming the success. And once it does that, it's going to roll to the second node and repeat the same steps, which is restarting the Apache service and confirming the success. And so we'll kind of build out that playbook as part of this. So let's get right into it. So I'll open up VI and just type rolling restart Apache and begin with the three dashes and dash name rolling restart Apache. For host, I'll put demo. In the inventory file, the managed nodes are under the demo group. For gather facts, I'm gonna set that to false. Become, I will set true. And in between gather facts and become, I'm gonna add one more line and that'll be serial. And I will give that a value of one and just add a little comment here for clarity. Because I have the value set to one, this playbook will run against one host at a time. I'm gonna add my task here next. And since we are going to be doing a restart of Apache, I wanna call the service module. So that's what I'm doing here with the service colon. And then the name of the service is HTTPD, which is Apache. And I'm gonna set my state to restart and this will complete the playbook, so let's begin running it. All right, next we wanna begin invoking our playbook. So I'm gonna type ansible-playbook, rolling restart Apache, and then dash i for demo inv, which is my inventory file, and then to finish it off with a dash k and a dash uppercase k. As you can see here, when I ran it, it did throw an error and I immediately know what this is. This is an uh, issue or a typo with the playbook. Um, at the very end, I'd said, uh, set it to restart. However, it should be restarted. So if we go back to our playbook and change the state from restart to restarted, that will correct it and we should be good now to run. So I'll reinvoke the command, just hit the up arrow to get that command again and it's running it and that completed so that was actually very quick um, i do have my host here on the bottom here both the bottom left and right uh, so let's just slow this down i'm actually gonna reopen my playbook and i'm gonna call the pause module and so this will just slow this down um, i'll add i think yeah, I'll pause it for five seconds. And this is how you do do this, calling pause, setting the seconds, and I'm gonna just set that to five, like I said. Right quit out and go back. And if I reinvoke this playbook again, you'll see the update. It'll begin on the bottom right, and then you'll see it again on the bottom left here. And five seconds, there's the one on the left. That will also go through the five second pause and it completed successfully. And that completes this video covering the serial feature in Ansible. Rolling restarts are an absolute must when managing critical infrastructure. So if you guys enjoyed this video, please smash the like and subscribe. You guys keep me motivated to continue making these videos. Any comments or suggestions would be greatly appreciated. Thanks and take care until next time.